Well, good day to my mates. Our scripture today, Proverbs 8, Proverbs, where all the wisdom is held, uh, 8 verse 18. And it's uh, God talking. He says, I have riches and honor, as well as enduring wealth and justice. Verse 19, my gifts are better than gold, even purest gold. My wages are better than sterling silver. So what, what is God saying here? Well, he's saying basically my ways, it's God's ways, are better than the world's ways. And if you're like me in life, we can either go the world's ways or our ways, or we can go God's ways in just about everything. And this is a great scripture to remind us that the better way is always God's way. So what does that mean? Well, let's talk about finances for for a moment. Most of the time, uh, this world tells us that more is better. Uh, bigger house, faster car, create, hoard, success, uh, climb that corporate ladder, power. But what God is saying is my ways are better, my gifts. What are God's gifts? Uh, his gifts are the fruit of the Spirit. His gifts is love, joy, peace, health, kindness, goodness. Uh, his ways are better. And as we study this scripture, if you think that, God, that the world's ways will make you happy, then you're going to be deceived. You're going to fall short. God's ways are better. One of God's ways is to build time in your life where you can put God first. Seek Him first. Seek you first the kingdom of God and all His righteousness. So I want you to remind you today, God's ways are better. Are you seeking God's ways today? Or are you following the world's ways I encourage you. God's ways are enduring. God's ways are better. God's ways are better. Hope that helps you today. God bless.